Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do your daily vibes for tomorrow. Um, so right around the 8th, give, give or take a couple of days. So yeah, so yeah, right around the right around the 8th, give or take. So this reading is not sign specific, and it's really not time specific. Um, yeah, so I'm going to try to make this a little bit quicker than the last one. I got a reading booked right after this, like in half an hour. So we're going to try to make this happen. Ten of Wands reversed, Nine of Swords reversed, and the Magician. So we have somebody here that is uh, making a conscious change to let go of something. This is a release. A release of anxiety. A release of stress. Well, that sounds good now, doesn't it? Um, it's like with the Nine of Swords... You need to be careful because something is really, really weighing you down. Something is really stressing you out. And I think that somebody is, is, is definitely experiencing some stress. Okay, this is a very stressful situation. But this is making a conscious change to drop it, to drop a stressful situation. Um, could be a relationship. It's like somebody's somebody may be, you know, they've been... <laughs> Repeating the same patterns over and over and over again, but I think that we have somebody here that is is just ready. I'm just ready for a change. I, I can't do this anymore. So this is taking back their power. This is somebody that is taking action, that is willing to shed this weight or this stressful situation. Somebody could be even really finding the resources to shed weight, like physical weight. But this can also be baggage. It can be something something else that is overwhelming. It could be your own um, negative thoughts, your own negative patterns. This is using the resources and finding the passion within to take action to break free from this stressful situation. So somebody is finding the resources. Um, this is also um, a divine connection. So using the powers from above as an advantage. There's some sort of advantage. Somebody has a divine connection. It's like they're being helped from above. This is success. It's a successful release, a successful change. Chariot, this is success. This is success, victory. Somebody is, is getting them, this is finding the discipline, finding the willpower to take back control. This is very similar. So this is taking control of a situation, getting in the driver's seat, taking control, moving away from a stressful situation. That's what this is. Somebody is moving. They're literally packing up and moving, leaving the burden, leaving the baggage, leaving the despair and the anxiety and the worry behind. Somebody has been holding on for too long. They've been holding on and it's been causing them a lot of stress. But now they're they're really getting in the driver's seat and getting the hell out. So this is somebody that is getting the hell out. I'm out. I'm out of this stressful situation. I'm not carrying this anymore. This is somebody that is, is replacing fear with faith and they are moving forward. Somebody could be moving, literally moving. And they could be moving very, very quickly. Wherever they're going, they're headed in the right direction. Ooh, new journey. Somebody is headed towards uh, a new destination. Starting over, starting from scratch. 
Somebody has found their discipline and their willpower to let go of a disturbing situation. And they are starting over, starting over from scratch. Freedom. This is breaking free and this is some, this is freedom. I'm free. This is exciting. This is very exciting. It's an exciting new beginning here. Somebody has really taken their power in their own hands. And they may have even manifested a new beginning because they let go of something. This is this could be somebody headed in. Standing their ground. Somebody is standing their ground. Defending themselves. Back up. Get away from me. That's what I hear. Back up. Somebody has put themselves back on top. It's like they've picked themselves up from rock bottom. I got to do what's right for me and it's time for me to start over. Moving forward very, very quickly with the chariot and the eight of wands. This is fast forward movement. Quickly leaving a very burdensome situation behind. This is, this is, this could happen suddenly. It could be. This person just decides to take a risk. It's like, this is, it's risky, but I got to go. I got to do, I got to protect myself. I got to do what's right for me. So we do have somebody, this is like, this could be sudden movement. Nine of wands. Now this is wounded. We have a very wounded individual here who has decided to protect themselves and set some boundaries. Four of Cups. Not seeing somebody was not seeing. They were focused on a loss. Not seeing that there was another opportunity. A bright one. This person has been. Refusing to see that there's an opportunity for love. Refusing. It's right there. He knows it's there, but he hasn't been, he's been refusing to look at it, refusing to see it. So we have somebody here that's been focusing on probably another person or another relationship, ignoring this, this big cup of love, totally ignoring it. Closed off emotionally. King of Swords reversed. We have a person here that closed off their heart. Shut their heart down. But this person up here is taking action. It looks like this person is looking over at this idiot. <laughs> There's a lost opportunity here. This is the wounded. This could be your wounded warrior right here. This is a wounded warrior. We got a wounded warrior looking at this idiot over here who has closed off their heart, not seeing a big opportunity. I think this wounded warrior is going to take action. Oh my God, what the hell is this? This 
This is things happening very, very, very fast with the Chariot and the Eight of Wands. We have a new beginning here, starting over, starting from scratch. This is risky, but... It's risky, but there's competition. And it's like this person wants to ward off the competition. Wants to have it all. Sees an opportunity for wish fulfillment. I think what has happened here, I think what has happened here is that there's an opportunity for wish fulfillment. To have it all. And we got somebody here that is about to really get in the driver's seat. And they could actually show up. They could show up. They're going to take a risk. They see an exciting opportunity. It's like they see an opportunity to for happiness. So I think we have somebody here that is about to show up. Suddenly show up and face their fears. It's like they find their, they do. It's like they get in the driver's seat and they just say, yeah, I'm going for this. I'm, it's too good to be true. It's so good. I got to go get it. This is so good. I got to go get it. And it looks like whoever this person is, it's like they just, all of a sudden, it's like, you know, I have the resources. I'm strong. It's like this person sees that another person has lost an opportunity. And this <laughs> is exciting. This is this this person sees an exciting opportunity. It's like this one man's loss is another man's treasure. Isn't that what that is? Or one man's trash is another man's treasure. That's what we got here. That is this is a passionate opportunity. This is a new spark. This is a new flame. This person sees an exciting opportunity. It's like, and this is instant, sudden, very sudden. It's like this person sees that this person <laughs> has lost, the, isn't taking it, not taking it, isn't focused on it, is wasting time. They see that this person is abusive by the looks of things. And it's like, you fool, you fucking fool. Excuse my language. So I think we have this wounded warrior who's about ready to take action. He sees an exciting opportunity that somebody else has lost. He's like, you, 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 <laughs> you don't want it. I'll take it. This is a, this is a, a new spark, a new flame, a new excite. This is it. Uh, look at it. It's hot. It's like all of a sudden this person decides to just go for it. We got somebody here that is really about to, to just take action. This is action, 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 action. Action. This is action being taken. We have this, this, this warrior here who has been wounded, who sees an opportunity and this opportunity looks really good. It's attractive. We got this one person who has missed the opportunity. They're not taking it. It's like, okay. King of Cups reversed. Whew. Closed off. It's like somebody, this person isn't communicating. This person has closed off emotionally. This person is withdrawn, not giving any love. Doesn't have, isn't doesn't have any love to offer, isn't mastering their emotions, can't master their emotions, can't communicate. Fool. We have we have a fool here. We do have a fool. 
And we have another person that is about to take a risk. They're about to take a leap. They're about, this is a this is replacing fear with faith, and this one is too. So somebody is about to take a leap. They're about to take a leap of faith right into something. It's like this is an opportunity for me. So I feel like we have somebody that is really about to face their fears and take action and go after somebody else's loss. Oh my gosh. We have the nine of pentacles on the bottom. This is a this is a very self-sufficient individual who has money. This is a business owner. This is somebody who can take care of themselves and is absolutely ready. This is somebody who knows their value, knows their worth, has worked hard to obtain success on their own. This person is doesn't need anybody. So if you are this person, you got you got somebody coming in. This is somebody that is independent and single, doesn't need anybody. I can do whatever I need to do on my own. Very self-sufficient, very capable and successful. So we have a successful individual here is about to get snapped up. That's what we got here. We got this person right here. Says, oh, this is like your hero. <laughs> I got a reading to do here in a minute, so. He's about to accept the challenge. This guy is about to accept the challenge. Fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. We may have a water sign or an air sign that dropped the ball. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, doesn't have to be, could go vice versa. But it's like, so we got this, you, you don't see this big opportunity, this is, this is big love, okay, this is a big, the Ace of Cups, this is an opportunity for love and passion. You don't want it, I'll take it. Could be dealing with an Aries or a Gemini, Cancer. Either way, we have somebody that is moving in very quickly, and they are moving right in. Like, pew. here I am. Good luck. Be prepared. This is messages or somebody arriving. There could be texts. There could be, it could be a phone call. It could be somebody actually showing up at your door. This is Aries as well. So we have Aries, we have Cancer, we have Gemini or Aries. We have Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. And then we have the Nine of Pentacles, which is, could be anybody. It's a very self-sufficient person that doesn't need another person and is ready and is waiting and is valuable and they know their value and somebody sees it. Somebody sees that this person is valuable and it's like, you don't want it? The other person, let 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 you, let her go, let him go. It's like, I'll take it. One man's trash is another man's treasure, and that is what we got here. Good luck. Communication, messages, or arrival. Wish. This is a wish being granted. Gotta go. <laughs> this this is this is like I I want this. I want it. The rest of you can get out of here. I want this. I want it. I want this fresh new start. I want this new beginning. This is somebody finding their faith. They're replacing fear with faith, and they're like, I am. This is I'm going for it. I am going for it. <laughs> Good luck. <laughs> 